All right, what up guys? It's your boy Death Galaxy here. I'm uh, just going to be going over the update 1.05 patch notes for Xbox Rust Console Edition. Uh, so I do know I missed the last one, the 1.04. Basically, the biggest updates there was they did patch the launch site glitch in the window, so you can no longer do that. Uh, and I haven't been able to play much the last few days, so I'm actually not too sure what's going to even be in this update. But uh, let's go over it together here. I'll read everything for you. Alright, so patch 1.05 is releasing today for Xbox. They need some more time to do it for PlayStation, so the update is not out for PlayStation yet, but I'm sure it will be coming soon. Uh, so let's start with here. We got the crash fixes. Fixed a major crash related to party chat. I'm assuming that's where sometimes if you'd uh, join too quick, it would make you crash. I heard some people had that issue. It's kind of weird, but they fixed that. Fixed more crashes that happen when loading the game. Fixed a crash related to workbenches. Not sure what that was. Fixed a crash when throwing timed explosive charges. I also never had that. Fixed a crash that could occur when highlighting certain blueprints. Not sure about that. Fixed a crash when changing skins. Not sure about that either. Fixed this crash when somebody's using a flamethrower near you but far enough away for it not to be heard. Okay, interesting. I wasn't sure that they were that loud, but that's good they fixed that. Fixed a crash that could occur when adding fuel to boats. I never had that. I don't know if these are mostly for like the old gen consoles, but uh, I'm using the Series X. I never had like any of these issues here. Uh, fixed the space boats. Boats should now remain on land and water. Okay. Fixed the exploit allowing players to be able to swim under the map. They will now be killed instantly. Oh, interesting. I haven't seen that. Alright, and fixed an issue causing the attack helicopter to target players underwater. Okay, so I guess if you're getting chased by the attack helicopter, just run for the water now. Uh, fix the audio not playing properly for certain screens in the main menu. Fix the bug causing weird player movements when hit by projectiles. I'm not too sure what's up with that one either. Uh, fix the bug causing items to fall through foundations and boats. Now I did have a few items fall through a foundation and boats actually. One time I hit a bunch of barrels and I went to drop my buddies in low grade. It all fell through the boat. I should have put it in the box I know but I'm glad they fixed that now. Alright now graphics and UI. They fixed an issue where the tool covered UI would show too early causing negative resources. Yeah, the, the tool cupboard thing has been a bit laggy and a bit off, like sometimes I would have more than a day's worth in there, but it would say I had like less than a day, but usually when I logged in the next time it would all be straightened out, so it's good they fixed that. They fixed an issue when attempting to respawn on a destroyed sleeping bag would disconnect a player. Interesting, not sure about that. Fixed an issue causing supply drops to go invisible once they landed. And now if you can see even in a uh, couple videos I uploaded getting supply drops, even on the new Series X, they were going invisible. And you kind of just had to time it. You could still see the parachute, but yeah, they were always going invisible and I'm glad they fixed that. Uh, also fixed an issue where the splitting UI would stay open after splitting resources. And polished language is now supported in the game. And also they have a quality of life and performance improvements. Animals no longer target players in the safe zones and guards turrets can now shoot animals. Alright, so it's weird that they said that update, but I actually, uh, I have a video of guard versus bear and uh, he was shooting the bear already. So maybe that more means less of uh, at the outpost because I haven't seen them shoot the animals down there. But bandit camp, they do shoot the animals, they don't play. But yeah, so that's basically, that's patch 1.05. Uh, it's coming out today live on August 10th. Uh, just for the Xbox, PlayStation, you guys are going to have to wait a couple days or so. But Xbox players, all these new fixes are coming today. And hopefully uh, there's a lot more to come. I was hoping for solo servers as I do feel the game is overrun with Zerg right now, which kind of makes it not as fun. But uh, I'm not going to complain about that. Still surviving as a solo player. And someday they will add the solo servers and everything will be great. So uh, thanks for watching, guys. Make sure to leave a like and subscribe and have a great day. Take care.